Hey, what's up guys? Jose here, ShreddedDab.com. In today's video, I wanna show you how to attach wrist straps to your barbell so that you can use them as safety squat bars. Now, one of the reasons people use safety squat bars is because it gives you the ability to squat if you have shoulder problems. Now, with a regular squat with a barbell, you have to bring your shoulders back, but if you have shoulder issues, then that can cause pain. By using a safety squat bar, you're bringing the arms in front of you, and that, that takes a lot of the stress out of the shoulder joint. However, when you're bringing the arms forward, you're also flattening the upper back a little bit. So you wanna make sure when you get under the bar here that when you're like this, you're retracting your shoulder blades, okay? That's gonna create a stable base for the bar to sit on. So you're gonna grab your wrist strap, wrap it around the bar, thread it through the end loop, and then just pull all the way up until this hits the top and it creates a knot there. Make sure they're tight, pull on them real good. And now what we're gonna do is we're getting under the bar. Again, remember, you wanna pull the shoulder blades back to create a stable base at the same time. You wanna pull the straps forward and down a little bit, and that's gonna create a stable base so that it's not wobbly. Once you have that on there, take a step forward or back, and then you do your squats. Up. Down. And that takes all the shoulders out of the whole squat, just like that. Now, another option you have, and if you don't have wrist straps, you can buy some of these. Th these are soft, soft tie loops, very inexpensive. Again, same concept. Throw it over the bar, thread it through the loop, and these actually give you a better handle because you have a loop at the end that you can hang on to with your hand. And it's just that simple. Now you can use the regular bar as a safety squat bar if you have shoulder issues. I hope you liked the information in this video. If you liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Leave me your comments and questions down below. And also make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss the latest uploads. Now, if you're looking for more gym hacks, DIY, garage gym equipment reviews, make sure you head over to my website, shredditdad.com. Thanks for watching, have a great day.